The world is full of good news. The following are just a few. As part of a nationwide amnesty program that in 2011 has freed 4,000 people nationwide, the Tajik government announces further support in the form of several months' living expenses as well as job training, with officials in the northern region of Kujand saying that they have begun implementing the program, intended to help the newly released rebuild their lives. Commending tennis star Serena Williams is past work in supporting disadvantaged youths. The UN Children's Fund, or UNICEF, appoints the American champion player as an international goodwill ambassador to assist in achieving goals such as providing quality education for all vulnerable students. To encourage an end to the harmful smoking habit, the federal agency Health Canada unveils updated graphic warnings for cigarette packaging, giving tobacco companies until March 21, 2012 to adopt new labels that must cover a full 75% of both front and back of the packets. The five UN member states of Angola, Armenia, Bosnia and Herzegovina, Costa Rica and San Marino add their country's names to the Paris Commitments, a declaration that has now been joined by 100 nations in seeking to protect vulnerable children from recruitment into illegally armed groups. US-based Boeing Commercial Airplanes delivers to Japan's All Nippon Airways, or ANA, the first model of the long-awaited 787 Dreamliner passenger jet, a large carrier that is the most fuel-efficient in the industry, and the first to use strong, lightweight composite materials for the majority of its construction. Around 700 imprisoned members of Spain's Basque ETA group, jailed throughout France and Spain, endorse a 2010 agreement as they renounce violence in favour of supporting peaceful means to achieve the group's goal of Basque independence.